Hey guys, I'm Reed Alexander from Nickelodeon's iCarly and author of the new cookbook, Cool Bites. You're watching Celeb Secrets for You. So, Reed, you have your new book out, Cool Bites. Can you tell me a little bit about it? I am so excited. My new book is launching. Check it out. Cool Bites, 100 Nutritious, Delicious, and Family-Friendly Dishes. It is on stands now, and I'm so excited. I've been working on this for the past almost two years. Wow. Can't believe it. Time flies. But the book is themed after my website, coolbites.com, which mm -hmm. really inspired it. What you're going to find in here are 100 better for you, delicious takes on all your classic family favorites. Everything from apple pie to chicken nuggets to uh, chocolate soup. Play. It really runs the gamut. Breakfast, dinners, desserts, of course, can't resist that. But it's all delicious, you know, and it's easy, it's fast, it's affordable, it's accessible. So I think there's something in here for everyone. What do you think your favorite dish is? Ah, it's a hard choice, but it's not a hard choice. <laughs> <laughs> I love my vegetable dumplings. Mm -hmm. They're so great. They take me right back to my favorite dim sum cafe. They're in a traditional Hong Kong style. Mm -hmm. Dim sum is just this really great kind of Chinese tapas in a way, mm -hmm. like little bites of food. And the vegetable dumplings, they're a mosaic of all colorful, delicious veggies inside. Everything from peppers to uh, water chestnuts, all these traditional Asian ingredients that you can easily find. And all you do, you mix together the filling with some soy sauce and some other flavors, and you have some sesame seeds. You fold it up in wonton wrappers and then steam them, and you can see all of the colors just exploding. And then they have a dipping sauce, which is made with lemongrass. Mm. It's so flavorful, but zero fat. The recipe is so, so good for you. So that's one of my favorites, and I'm telling you, we make a huge batch in my house. I'll cook like 100, and they're literally gone in maybe three and a half minutes. Like, that's it. The time it takes to do a cooking segment on TV. <laughs> so now you were on the Today Show the other day. How was that experience? It was so much fun. I can't believe, you know what? It's been my eighth time, and it's just wow. so crazy to think about all of the fun we've had in that kitchen. I love Kathy Lee and Hoda. They're so awesome. It was a huge privilege to be able to launch my first book there at Studio 1A. And we loved it. You know, we made three recipes, my Vietnamese summer rolls, and then we made my peanut butter chocolate chip cookie bars, which were a cross between a candy bar and a cookie cake, <laughs> one of my all-time favorites, and then my Cool Crunch bars, which are a homemade take on an energy bar, minus the store-bought wrapper, and they feature almonds and walnuts and dried fruits. So we really had a great time, and Kathy Lee and Hoda enjoyed it so much. I'm just excited to come and see them again. That's so nice. So now you are a spokesperson for Bill Clinton's campaign mm -hmm. and Michelle Obama's exactly. campaign. How is that? That is so amazing. It is such a huge honor. Yeah, thank you. Working with President Clinton. In fact, he gave the cover quote for the book, so <laughs> which nice. is pretty cool. He calls it a valuable guide for a new generation. Um, so big thanks to him. You know, he's amazing. He's a great inspiration for me. He's been a great friend and mentor. And his foundation is just incredible. The humanitarian work that they do around the world, whether it's in Haiti, whether it's in Rwanda, Rwanda and Hong Kong is really staggering, but I think what's so great about the Alliance for a Healthier Generation, which is the program that I am a representative for, it's really the largest program of the Clinton Foundation Center here in the U.S., mm -hmm. is that it's engaging schools and it's engaging families on a grassroots level that's never been done before. So we've had so many great campaigns, whether it's launching a special menu of my recipes in 18,000 schools, being cooked for 30 million kids every day, to working with the president at his annual summits on health and moderating panels and making speeches and presentations, to visiting the schools and seeing how the statistics regarding childhood obesity, which are very depressing, are being mm -hmm. turned around. I mean, that to me is very uplifting and um, it's very hopeful. And then also with First Lady Michelle Obama with her Let's Move campaign, love working with them. Mm -hmm. I had the chance to be her special guest at her kids' state dinner, the first one she did, which was so much fun. And now this year I'm spearheading her Let's Move Salad Bars to Schools program, which is in tandem with the White House working with Whole Foods to mm -hmm. open salad bars, fully operational salad bars in thousands of schools across America in the cafeterias. And the statistics there are really cool. Three times as many fruits and veggies eaten by kids when they have access to a salad bar than when they don't. Mm -hmm. So it's great stuff and it's really important to have their clout and their leadership behind mm -hmm. this issue. That's great. So now did you reach out to them or did they reach out to you? <clears throat> ah, that's a great question. Well, in terms of Let's Move, they invited me to come to the White House. That's amazing. For, it was so much fun, yeah, for a meeting with uh, First Lady, mm -hmm. Michelle Obama's team, her chef, Sam Cass, and I met her before several times. She's been on our show, of course, like Carly. So that was really great to uh, to hear from them and the genuine excitement. And then um, on the Alliance for Healthier Generation, the Clinton Foundation, that was really organic because I had just been on the Today Show the first time. Mm -hmm. And I say organic, no pun intended for a food lover. <laughs> what I really like about that is uh, the Alliance and I were both kind of looking for partners that have the same kind of passion about this message that we each individually do. 
too. So the Alliance was looking to find someone to really engage their youth base, whether it's in schools or through iCarly, something along those lines. And I was looking for an organization that would help me to have access mm -hmm. to those schools and also the families. So the way we came together was really a meeting of the minds back in, I guess it was September 2010. It's been almost three years. Can you believe it? We're celebrating our three-year anniversary. <laughs> <laughs> uh, can't forget to take somebody out to dinner. Right? Isn't that the protocol? Um, but, you know, that was just a really fantastic way for us both to be able to connect with organizations organizations and brands, whether it's Cool Bites or whether it's the Clinton Foundation, to spread our message far and wide. That's awesome. Now I know you are going to be at NYU this mm -hmm. semester. Yes. How is that, the college experience? So thrilled. I just started. I can't believe my first day was September 3rd, the day that my book came out. <laughs> <laughs> so I had a good excuse, I think, for skipping <laughs> class. Wasn't playing hooky, but um, I'm really enjoying it. I've already been to the campus, and I've met so many great friends, and I'm in this really cool program called the Gallatin Institute, which allows you to create your own curriculum, concoct your own class with your professors, mm -hmm. bringing outside professors who are successful in their individual fields. And um, it's going to be great because I'll be able to do my first semester while on the road. 20 cities, four months, cross-country book tour, and uh, NYU along for the ride. But I can't, I, I just can't wait to be in the Big Apple. That's you know, I so love this fun. city. I've loved it for years. So relocating here should be a lot of fun. Cool. And now what's next for you? I know you mentioned the book tour. So much. I'm writing a column for the Huffington Post. I'm so nice. thrilled. So check it out very, very soon. It's going to be all over the internet burning up the charts, we hope. Um, and then I'm working on some new programs right now, both in acting and in lifestyle. So now with this book, hopefully coming out with a new book soon enough. <laughs> Already thinking about round two, getting ready to travel a lot. We'll be heading overseas. And uh, this book is going to be worldwide, which is so great. So we're just looking forward to all of these huge projects right around the uh, the woodworks. That's cool. That's so much fun. Congratulations on all your success. Thank you And we so look much. forward to reading the book and everything Enjoy in the future. Enjoy it. Hope you love all the recipes. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Thank you.